What's going on guys, Orzio here and welcome back to a brand new video. So today we have got the new team of the season, Talishka card, to review. And it is a card that is looking ridiculous. He has got 92 pace with 95 dribbling, 94 shooting, 92 passing with 86 physicals. He's a six foot three player with high low work rates, five star skill moves and a four star weak foot. EA just didn't upgrade the stats. They also gave him a skill move upgrade as well. Now the price. 850k he's going for a lot he is going for a lot of coins and he's actually extinct at that price as well now the chem style hunter that's what i've gone for but you could also go for an engine chem style the engine chem style does look very good on his card because you're giving him the extra balance it's just the hunter chem style looks ridiculous maxed out pace with a hunter 99 acceleration 99 sprint speed look at those shooting stats with the hunter chem style as well 99 attacking positioning, 99 finishing, 99 shot power, 99 long shots, 99 volleys with 95 penalties. Hold on. It doesn't stop there. Finesse shot trait, outside foot shot trait. Like, are you serious? Those shooting stats with the traits as well, with a four-star weak foot, it looks crazy. The passing stats look very, very good as well. He's got 90 vision with 99 free kick accuracy, 85 crossing, 95 short passing, 93 long passing with 98 curve as well. His dribbling ability for a player that is six foot three looks unreal. And he has got a body type, which we do not see very often. And it's the high and lean body type. The only other person that I know that has got that body type is Isaac. That's the only other person. I don't think anyone else actually has that body type in this game. But yeah, Talishka's, Talishka's body type with those dribbling stats. Yeah, it looks solid, man. It looks really, really solid. He's got 99 agility with 86 balance, 90 reactions, 96 ball control, 95 dribbling with 88 composure. I'm definitely expecting him to feel really solid on the ball, especially with five-star skill moves as well. Now, the physicals. 75 jumping isn't anything amazing, but he has got 92 heading accuracy, which is really nice. How is he, has he got a power header trait? He has not. He's got 94 stamina, 86 strength with 77 aggression as well. That strength being at 86 is solid, and the stamina, obviously, you guys know, that's going to be enough to last for the whole 90 minutes as well. Now, the links. League-wise, it isn't anything outstanding for links. But you do get a nice strong link to the new Romarinho card that just came out. So yeah, I guess that's a decent link in that in that league. But other than that, I don't think there's really anyone else. Now, when it comes down to the nationality, oh, now that's a whole different story because you got players like Vinny, you got players like Neymar, you got players like Fernandinho, you got players like Fred as well. So yeah, the Brazilian nationality is always going to be nice to work with when it comes down to links in this game. Now, positions. Two positions, the cam position and the striker position. The only thing I'm questioning about playing this card in a cam position is the high-low work rates. I feel like if I play him in that cam position, he's going to be so aggressive there anyway, to the point where he's probably going to act like another striker. But we're definitely going to try him there just to see how it's going to be. But yeah, let's get into the games and let's see how good this card is going to be. He's going to push towards me here. He is. Just chip it over to Fernandinho. Give it into Mane. Talishka giving me a passing option. Nice scoop turn. Good ball roll to get that angle towards a near post. And just like that, we have ourselves our first goal. He's going to push towards me with Chiellini here. He is. That's a nice ball roll scoop turn. Good run from Talishka there. Go for another ball roll scoop. Good turn again. Go on, keep it going. Look at the pace. Look at the pace. What is that pace to get in front of Chiellini? Like, Chiellini had so much, so much space on him as well to cover that gap. And Talishka still got around. Go for a quick dummy, then driven out into the middle. Talishka does like coming short there. That is something I've noticed twice now. I'm going to just keep it going. Ball roll the keeper. There's no way he went in with his feet. Like, what am I seeing? That was a good pass, though. Can I get around to Romane? It's going to be a struggle. But look at Virgil van Dijk getting outpaced. Pass it into the middle. That's not a good pass. Hold on, though. Beautiful skill move. No, bad touch. We recovered, though. Reverse elastico. That's beautiful. Go on. He used the stronger foot there. I thought he was going to use the four-star weak foot. I'm kind of surprised he used the stronger foot there, but I'm not complaining. As long as it goes in, I'm happy. I'm just going to smack the ball up to him. I know he hasn't got a great jumping ability, but he's six foot three, so I'm expecting him to win those as long as he's in front of the player. But it looked like Chiellini just kind of pushed him out the way. Let's give the ball back to him. Accelerate into the space. Look at that, by the way. Nah, I badly timed it. You see the acceleration, though? That is crazy. We'll roll that. Give that into Mane. Give that into Talishka now. 
see if we can maybe play a nice pass here. I'm looking for Mane, but yeah, it was covered really well. But look at that pass to Saka. Perfect. I'm going to hit him with a Burma spin. He didn't expect it. Good pass into Talishka. Nice turn. Roulette that. Did it way too early. But have we still got it? Go on, keep fighting. No. Whoa. Ref. Ref, are you serious? Are you serious? I am so surprised Talishka got his leg that high that quick. What? How is he going to blow the whistle there, though? We have another goal. Trying to get this ball into the middle. There you go, Ox. Take a touch. Driven that. Good pass into Fernandinho. Nice pass into Talishka. Good turn. That's beautiful. Near post on that stronger foot. Look how his skill moves come off. I'm telling you guys, the skill moves with this card is coming off really nicely. And this guy is going to quit. Was it 1-0? It was 1-0. Go on, Rivaldo. Keep it going. There you go. Early pass into the inside. Nice dummy. I tried to take that touch just before the defender. But uh, yeah, it didn't really go well. And then I tried to tackle and he ended up taking a shot. Ox is wide open in that middle. Nice touch into Talishka. Good dummy as well. Just going to use his pace now to go down that line. I'm really surprised how often he's coming short, by the way. Like with his high-low work rates, I would have thought he would have been way, way more aggressive. But he definitely likes to come short. This guy's AI defending right now. I'm going to go for this. That was a ridiculous angle. I wasn't even expecting that to go on target. He might push towards us here. Let's chip it over. Edge of the box. Go on. It, it was a very, very hard volley to uh to score. But you never know, right? You never know. Especially with his 99 volleys, it could have flew in. Is Mane going to make a run? I'm actually going to tell him to come short. Give it into Fernandinho. Nice pass into Talishka. I tried to green time it. I had some space as well to run into. So I probably should have gone for it. But I just wanted to see how his shot was going to be on the edge of the box there. Let's see if we can score a header with him. His jumping ability isn't great. But he's six foot three, and he has got good heading accuracy. So if he gets onto the header, it is going to be a good header. It's just the issue is getting him onto it. I definitely want to try to go for finish with him. And this is a very good angle. And look at that. Green timed. He's got the finish shot trait. He's got 99 shot power. And he has got 99 long shots as well. Nice scoop turn for Mane. Talishka is going to make that run coming across from his uh, right striker position. And look at the pace. Fake shot that. No, that is such a perfectly timed slide tackle because if I get that fake shot off, that's it. We have ourselves a goal. Now, let's go for it again. Come on, Teleshka. That's decent. Please. No. How is he not winning that there? Like, come on. You're six foot three. I thought he was going to be wide open. He did get challenged a little bit, but it wasn't like a proper challenge, was it? Edge of the box, Teleshka. Good Elastico, reverse Elastico through the middle as well. The combo coming out to play and it works perfectly. I need someone to come short here. There you go, Fernandinho into Mane. Good pass. Through the middle to Talishka. I'm just going to hit it into that far corner. And the animation wasn't anything amazing there. I was expecting like a power shot, a power shot animation. It just looked like he was trying to place it into the corner there. I think he's getting marked by Foden. And we all know Foden is not a tall player. Let's see what we can do. Roberto Carlos as well. Oh, come on. Come on. You see what I mean about his heading ability? Like, look how good of a header that was. It's just getting him onto the header is the issue. And he brought out Allison very far out. Roberto Carlos is near post as well. Hold on. Nah, it's a terrible cross from me. This guy is controlling Hullet a lot, but we have found a space. And I'm surprised Delishka got there, by the way. Look at, look at that. Just look at it. I'm telling you guys, the dribbling on this card is insane. You definitely sometimes notice like a six foot three feel to him. But like the left stick dribbling in most cases is solid. And the skill moves as well. The skill moves come off nicely, really nicely. Go for a Berber spin. That's beautiful, Veraldo. Nice uh, movement from Saka. Talish, good there. Giving me the option. See what I can do here. He has no idea. He has no idea where I'm going to go. And I tried to shut cancel the keeper as well. But he just didn't end up working. I'm just going to go for a cutback here. I see Rivaldo making a decent run, but I couldn't get it to him. Talishka sitting in front of the defensive line. Nice turn. Good Elastico. I have no words. I have no no words like his movement in the striker position is insane he's always in the right position giving me that passing option and then look what he can do on the ball 
when he receives it like come on so it is time to give my final thoughts on the card we ended up playing four games with Talishka and we scored eight goals in those four games his shooting ability oh yeah it definitely was up there the amount of power the accuracy as well placing it into the corner it was beautiful straight up beautiful and the fact that he's got both shooting traits as well is insane he did miss a few chances today but i'm expecting that not even on a player that has near enough perfect shooting stats i'm expecting every shot to go in it's just how it is in fifa 22 so yeah the shooting ability i was really happy with it the pace outrageous something i was doing over and over and over again was just picking up the ball with this guy and accelerating into the space and i matched up against team of the season virgil van dyke a few times today and yeah he had no chance he had no chance catching up to this talishka card so yeah talishka's pace insane the passing ability beautiful he's so good on both feet as well you can switch her switch her with the right foot you can switch it with the left foot as well so yeah passing beautiful dribbling ability oh yeah oh yeah the skill moves come off so nicely on this card and the left stick dribbling is really solid as well i'll be honest to you guys though you definitely sometimes feel his balance a little bit you definitely do but in most cases you don't it's just some some occasions i feel like it's the situations where he's under a little bit of pressure that's it but other than that yeah the left stick dribbling and the skill moves come off really good with him Yes, it could be improved. Like the balance could be improved with the engine chem style. But with how good that pace was today, I'm still going with the Hunter chem style on this card. The physicals. The strength was decent. It didn't really feel like he had 86 strength in some occasions though. He was a player that was getting pushed off the ball a little bit too easy for my liking. So yeah, the strength didn't really feel like 86. It felt more like 82, if anything. So I wasn't really happy with the strength, but I wasn't like super disappointed either. His jumping ability as well, not amazing. The thing is, right, is six foot three, okay? So if he gets onto the header, especially with 92 heading accuracy, it's going to be like an amazing header. It's just the issue I had with him was getting him onto that header. He was losing out on a few, few headers because of his jumping ability. So yeah, the jumping, nothing amazing. Now the price of this card, 850k. It's overpriced, 100%. Listen, he's amazing. He is, he's such a good card. But 850k for a player that's not in the top five leagues, yeah. It is not worth it. He's extinct, extinct right now, but I feel like he's extinct right now because of the hype around him, okay? So I definitely do believe this card 100% will drop in price. Even if EA go ahead and update his price range, I still see this card dropping under 850k. Now, where does he go in the attacker's tier list? He is such a nice card, man. I really did have a lot of fun using him today. His dribbling ability, as I told you guys, was really solid. It's just you definitely notice that balance time to time. The passing ability was beautiful. The shooting ability was beautiful. The pace was beautiful. The skill moves came off so nicely. The shooting traits as well. I am going to go ahead and put him into the S tier. I am. As I said, you notice the strength like being a little bit disappointing. And the jumping ability, obviously nothing insane, but everything else on this card is really good. So yeah, S tier for Talishka. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like, make sure to leave a comment. But for now, peace.